see how organized it is, guys? <laughs> exactly. I want to show you. This is how we kept up with it. Oh my gosh. Oh, hi, Hey, where's your robe? <laughs> Look at this. All the sous vide egg bites that we made are gone. Today I'm gonna make another batch. And tomorrow? The last one. Oh, this is the last one. It's the last one. And honey, yeah. one out of ten. Oh, yeah, it's like a nine. What would make it a ten? <laughs> because it looks perfect. Mm -hmm. I'm going to make those into a video. Sous vide yeah, bites that are from Starbucks. Yeah, people were not happy that you used the block. Yeah, they said it's not environmentally friendly. It's more practical for most people. Good morning. So there's this show that's on Netflix. It's not a Netflix original, but my cousin Kate told me about it. This one is more of a... Um, I guess kind of like drama. It's called You. And get this, it's a Lifetime show. When I was a kid, I remember Lifetime was like Unsolved Mysteries. I don't know, the older people channel. Oh my gosh. I just came to a realization. And when the older people... <laughs> But Lifetime, they're changing their branding. And then I heard that they did the um, R. Kelly, I think a documentary. I don't know. I'm not, I'm not interested in watching that. So adults, watch it when your kids are asleep because it is pretty. It's like rated R. It was such a chill last two days. And now I'm going to go to the gym. We still have a lot to declutter no. upstairs. It's right here, baby. Look, I told you. Shit. It's in your closet. No. What do you say? She's been looking for her Minnie Mouse pants forever and they were in her drawer the whole time. She said their drawer was so messy, there were so many pants. So I'm reorganizing it and of course the Marie Kondo method. It's right, I see it right there with my own eyes. Open your eyes. Yes, you can. And then put a shirt underneath, okay? Can you pick a shirt? So I did this method, go ahead. How organized it is, guys! <laughs> exactly. I want to show you. This is how we kept up with it. We did it. <laughs> it did the normal shirt. That's fine. You could wear that. So as you can see, we kind of kept up with it. But what happens is the kids will pick their own outfits, and then they change their mind and just throw it on top. And that's what happens here. It's kind of good that it gets like this, because that just means I need to. Um, declutter. They have so many leggings now that have holes in the knees. I keep forgetting to keep my receipts at Target because all the Cat and Jack, well most of the Cat and Jack pants that they have, they're sturdy so they don't get the holes in the knees but there's been a couple that I'm surprised they have and I don't have the receipt. So what's the policy on that? Because I know all Cat and Jack have a one-year warranty oh, done. but I never keep receipts. Done. That's a rosary. You touch the bead and then you say a prayer. Oh. I could already hear my mom's voice right now telling me what a bad Catholic I am. Because, you know, yeah, I don't go to church. But anywho, so the pants that do have holes in them, I end up turning them into like bike shorts so they could wear them under their dresses during the summertime. This is our pajama drawer. Still not bad, but could definitely be worked on. In fact, like this right here, the kids don't even fit this pajamas. They're way too tight, so we're gonna have to start another donation pile. Oh, this is kind of like the miscellaneous tutu drawer. Is there really a way to fold tutus? We just kind of throw them in there. Their sock drawer. Why are there, what is this? Okay, so I'll tackle this today. Let's go see at the Juliana's drawers. I'm kind of scared. Oh. Uh, yeah. Mm-hmm, see, she does that too. She just puts her shirts on top. Let's see the bottom drawers. Oh, that's an underwear drawer, that's okay, you could close that. Well, that's somewhat organized. And then again, two twos. Mm-hmm, that means I have to get rid of some sock drawer. In conclusion, I have not kept up. It's just time to kind of like reboot. Why are you 
faces. Oh, my faces. Bonk. So crazy. That's not a spider bite, honey. I don't know. Have you guys ever heard that fact that every human eats so many spiders a year? Because they crawl oh, yeah, in their mouth. Oh yeah, because if you sleep with your mouth open, just a saying. I mean, who knows if that's a fact? Like, who's actually studying that? Depending on where you live. Like, do you live under a bridge? <laughs> Question for you. Are you really gonna make that curry? I am. Is that what we're gonna eat for dinner tonight? Yeah. I'm gonna make a video for that. Um, 24 hour adobo. Oh. Eventually. Maybe in the next couple weeks. It's not that hard. And in fact, it's easier than regular adobo. So, could make it. And there's no video about it. So, 24 hour adobo. Yeah, you know what that is? It's actually inspired by the Disney pulled pork or Disney braised pork. It was inspired Allie, by that? Allie was the one that sent you the link. Are you sure? Oh, yeah. that's where she ate it? Yeah. Well, oh, that's dang. Where she ha I think where she had it fresh with her. So maybe we should thank Disney. Thank you, Disney. I'm going to be filming some videos. I'll talk to you later. Oh, okay. What are you going to do? Tutus up top, pants, pajamas. Uh, okay, this is just underwear drawer. Shirts and socks, socks and tights. Which, I mean, tights. I don't know. I just throw them in. I think that'll be okay. Juliana's pajamas and pants. So we're gonna do the rest later because I actually have to jump on a call and still have to make lunch. It's been too long, the co-op. If I could come here at least two times a week, I'd be so happy. I've got some videos I'm filming tomorrow for Benjamin TV. So just picking up some ingredients. Avocados, oranges, green onions, more eggs, of course, bacon, spinach, and organic beer. Can you guys guess what I'm cooking? Curry. Curry. Smells so good. There was um, a sheet on the bulletin board and it says, if you were a snowflake, where in the world would you like to land? Kira said, on a unicorn horn. Is that what you said? At the top of a unicorn horn. Mia said, the North Pole. And another kid wrote, on top of a garbage can. <laughs> on top of the carpet. That's why I love reading those because kids say the darnest thing. What did Ju Juliana say? Huh? She said I don't remember. Sweet. Oh, she Statue of Liberty or something, or on the Eiffel Tower. Oh, pretty. Good. 
Maybe. <laughs> Did you see your drawers? No, it's all messy. Are you gonna help me with your shirts? Yeah. Your shirts are a mess. Yeah, I don't care if they're a mess. JB, you should care. <laughs> look at this one. Why do I look like I have a cone head? Did you eat ice cream and you have a cone head now? I have no, water no. diapers in here too. Like that's how long it's been I since we've gone through Juliana's stuff. We haven't even opened them. Yeah, there's a baby beanie. Baby got got look at this thing. This isn't gonna fit your head. Baby got a water diaper. Baby Those got are just water sassy diaper. decorations. Miyako, you better quit the attitude. I'm gonna clean my dresser while you clean that, okay? What's up with these cute little hats? Go down, no medicine. medicine go down, medicine go down. Ta da! Much better. Here's all clothes. We're donating so far. I haven't even gone through their closets, which they have a lot of dresses that don't fit them anymore, and um, a ton of sweaters too that are too small. I'm gonna do that another day. This is a success so far. Oh, yeah, watch! Look at my giant roll up. Giant for roll up? I didn't even know that was a thing. We're watching how to make giant foods. No, uh, you saw how to make a giant gummy bear. Uh huh. And then what's the other one? Me yeah, and <laughs> Watch how to make a giant fruit roll up. Giant fruit roll up. I love that we can enjoy YouTube together. Ouch! Why does that comb hurt? I know they're like. Why does it hurt? They're like mini needles. <laughs> this is legit like needles, but I like it. I know, it does feel nice feels if it's, um, if it's gen brushed oh, gently, yeah. yeah. Daddy. You're a unicorn, look at your okay. face. <laughs> the book with no pictures. What says? What says that? It says the book with no pictures. Oh. <laughs> okay. All right, all right, all right. <laughs> has to say. That's the rule. I found every single one. So that means even if the words say, Lork, Wait, what? That doesn't even mean anything. Uh oh. <laughs> I am a monkey who taught myself to read. <laughs> okay. And now I am reading you this book with my monkey mouth and my monkey voice. <laughs> I don't know where that came from. That's not true. I'm not a monkey. Yes, I am a monkey. Robot. Also, I am a robot monkey. <laughs> what? Okay, what the? And my head is made of blueberry pizza. <laughs> Wait a second. Is this whole book a trick? No. And now it's time for me to sing you my favorite song. A song? Do I really have to sing a song? Yeah. Glug, 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 my face is a bug. I eat ants for breakfast right off the rug. <laughs> my only friend in the whole wide world is a hippo named Boo 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 Books for young readers. Penguin Young Readers Group. An imprint of Penguin Random House LLC. 375 Hudson Street, New York, New York. 10014. Copyright 2014 by BJ Novak. Thanks, BJ. Thank you! I really said all that. 
no, I didn't read that part. I missed that part. It's a book with no pi Okay, uh, can we get a real book? Yeah. Do you guys Tomorrow. like mommy's feet? Yeah. <laughs> Stop! <laughs> get some booty. Oh, honey, your toes are like raptor nails. <laughs> <laughs> I noticed in yesterday's vlog or the previous vlog people said they missed the it's Judy time videos and I don't think I'm gonna start up it's Judy time again I completely abandoned it I think it's been over a year since I posted on there or I don't know it's been a long time Kira I, what the dealio my tongue is white I don't have any plans on posting up any It's Judy Time videos. As for now, I've been thinking about possibly doing wow. It's Mommy's Life video and doing more sit down and chit chat and maybe like some Q and A's. I am inspired again. And if you guys have any questions, whether it's mommy questions or um, marriage questions or whatever, I mean, I'm by no means an expert in any of those fields, but I, I love hearing other people's experiences on a certain topic. And uh, that's what I can share is my experiences and what works for me and my family. If you guys have any questions around family topics or like relationships, Kira, what is that? <laughs> Comment them below. Bingy Baba. And if you made it this far, give this video a thumbs up. A 3900 thumbs up. 3900 of them. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye night. Bye night.